complete setup of Epson Workforce Pro WF4720. Open your browser and search for this website which is Epson.com and press the enter key. You will find this website where you need to scroll down and here you need to select a region. I am going to select USA. Then home page will open where you need to hover on support and click on printers. Now printer support page will open. Just scroll down and here you need to choose printer type. So it will fall under all in ones. Click on it. Now select series. So it is work for series. And now we need to choose printer model name. So I have selected printer model name just click on it and finally the printer page will open where you can see its name and image so now I'll also provide this link in this video description so that you can jump directly on this page so you need to scroll down and here you will find downloads tab and under downloads you can see operating system on which my PC is running you can set it manually and all drivers for your printer so this is recommended by Epson its name is drivers and utilities combo package installer so you can click on any driver name and you will find all detail about that as I have clicked here and you can see description and specification and compatible systems you can click on download button it will start downloading and then you can launch it so I have clicked on download and you can see it has been start downloading and uh, now it is downloading just wait till download will complete now download has been completed and uh, I'm going to launch it by clicking on open button Duly launch it will ask your permission to make changes to your device click on yes and after that this window will open where we need to click on ok to continue now file is extracting and here we need to accept license agreement and click on install now it is downloading software installation is completed now we need to complete setup click on next here you need to select your connection type like wireless connection or USB cable so I'm going to select wireless now click on next and choose if you are set up your printer for the first time so I'm selecting this one Here I am selecting using control panel. Your Wi Fi name will display you here. Click on next and you can follow these instructions on your printer control panel. You can follow these instructions. You need to enter the password of your wireless connection. Confirm wireless settings. Now select you whether your printer is connected to the network or it is offline. So I am selecting this one. So in this way you can follow on screen instructions to complete the setup of your apps and printer. So I hope this video was helpful to you. If you want any further help you can call us on the given number in this video description or click on the support link.